But I also really would like fu the functional programming community at large to think about those larger scale software systems and how what they do could benefit them. Especially because I knew that a lot of people, even though their papers are, you know, mention, you know, have paper, have programs that are three lines long, that what they do has architectural impact, right? But very rarely do they examine that aspect of what they do in their papers. So, right. And this, I, I, and I feel it, it's gotten much worse, right? I remember in the nineties when Haskell came out. So I kind of, the one thing, you know, Phil Wadler had this great paper on views, which are to abstract over the concrete structure of an algebraic data type, which is exactly about modularity, right? This is programming to requirements, but it's one of the very few examples. And if you look at an ICFP program these days, find the paper that actually shows you how to address a requirement using functional programming and it's difficult. And so I wanted to encourage people to write that. And since encouraging in the academic community means to give publication credit, the thing that I knew how to do was how to do um, a, work, a satellite workshop for ICFP, of which, you know, I chaired the scheme workshop. I've been on countless committees of the various other workshops. Uh, I knew how to run one, I had how to create one. Then I got together with Graham Hutton, uh, who also knew how to do this, uh, and he gracefully accepted uh, to to help create FunArch with me. So that's a works that's a satellite workshop of ICFP now, now just gone into its third iteration, where we try to get the functional people to write papers where they think about large scale systems 